Hi there, I'm Doc Kuzmich, tool service technician at Lyman's Testing Laboratories. At Lyman's, our certified technicians provide the proper inspection and maintenance protocols to ensure that you stay safe when you're on the job. Now today, I will walk you through the process of what happens when you send your Liveline tools in to LTL for their annual service and how you should inspect them before each use when you're out in the field. LTL recommends all Liveline tools to be cleaned and visually inspected each day prior to use. Make sure to inspect the surface of the tool for contaminants such as dirt, creosote, grease, oil, gas or other fuels, moisture or any other foreign material. If contaminated, use a quick rag wipe to improve the integrity of the fiberglass. Visually inspect the tool for a smooth glossy surface. Check for deep cuts, scratches, nicks, gouges or other signs of bruising or crushing. Pay special attention to the tip or working section of the tool. Do not use if any defects are found on the tool surface. Broken strands of fiberglass allow water to wick within the fiberglass itself, promoting dielectric failure or reducing insulating values. The tool should be tagged, removed from service, and sent to LTL for repair. LTL is a NAIL accredited high voltage testing, calibration and repair center that inspects and certifies Liveline tools per applicable standards. This is what happens when you drop off the Liveline tool at LTL. Once we receive it, our testing area identifies and matches the tool to its corresponding worksheet. The last test date and or issues with the tool are identified. The tool technician fills out an assessment sheet and documents the item. It will fall into one of three categories. One, cleaning, waxing, and testing. Two, cleaning, repair, part replacement, waxing, and testing. Or three, irreparable and must be replaced. The technician will remove any existing labels and clean any dirt, oil, and contaminants off the tool with a soft cloth and alcohol. Then using a specialty Liveline tool wax, the entire tool is waxed and polished. All surfaces are waxed using a hot stick wax. The technician ensures the wax is dry so the tool is properly protected when going through testing. All Liveline tools are tested in accordance with the IEEE standard 978-1984. This ensures the tool's integrity. The fiberglass tool is dielectric tested for leakage. 75 kilovolts AC is applied to the full length of the tool and measured every 12 inches. The tool is then visually and mechanically inspected before leaving LTL's lab. The technician must ensure that the leakage is stable and low with no hot spots over the entire tool and no flashover or burning occurs. Should such a condition occur, the tool will be taken out of service, reassessed and the proper remedy provided. Results are recorded, tracked, and passed on to our services team to process. Once complete, they are either shipped back to the customer or prepared for pickup. By following the processes outlined here in the field and lab, your hotline tools will be ready and safe to use each time. Thanks for watching, and for more information, visit www.ltl.ca or call 1-800-299-9769.